thesmartlocal.com Okay, hi guys! Hello! Okay, do you know what you're doing tomorrow? No. no. Tomorrow you're gonna wake up at 6am and you're gonna go for the SQ interview. Why oh, I got no reaction? <laughs> <laughs> That's really hard. It's not easy to get in. Yeah. I heard like there's more wrong with the ask open-ended questions like what is your favorite color? Like it's the kind Bruh. of good question that I will just be like what? I heard there's a debate wrong. Huh? I don't there's understand why. There's a debate. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Why I, you I don't know if you're supposed yeah. to be working on a plane. No, no. The debate with your the passengers. The passengers. <laughs> <laughs> it might seem like a small concern, but then uh, why is they ask me to shave my beard? <laughs> I'd be like, I might consider. But then, see how long? <laughs> Just don't want to be the first one to be kicked out. Oh my god! That's <laughs> all I'm concerned about. Suddenly become like them in terms of... Yeah, that's like... 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 Together, like, yeah. oh, I think for me it's the gracefulness, walking in the kabaya, trying to be like demure and stuff because I, I, I'm not naturally a very demure person. For me it's just trying to fake it till I make it up. So what we're gonna do now is Lina and I will give you a very brief crash course with very outdated material. <laughs> 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 wow. That will hopefully be of some use. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning everyone. Hi. Hi. Alright, uh, how prepared are you all for this uh, interview? Not very prepared. Uh, I spent the whole of last night trying to find my skirts. So that was a little preparation I did. As prepared as being told about this yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah. <laughs> what are your expectations basically? I feel like Sean and Amiru will get like, I want to at least get lunch. Uh. So let's go for an interview now. I wish you guys the best of luck. Okay. Have fun! Bye! Bye. <laughs> oh yeah. So I woke up at 7.30 Guess what time we were supposed to be here 7.30 And I got out of the house at 7.45 And this was done in 15 minutes Okay, good job A few moments later Okay, so this is the first person who got eliminated I never, They didn't talk to me, I just went there after they made me like reach for this thing uh -huh. And then I barely reached They brought me to one side, take my measurement And then they were like Sorry, you cannot make it. You're 157.4. Any, any last words? We'll see you on the other we'll side. Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you in maybe half an hour. <laughs> <laughs> So what happened? Okay, so my entire group got rejected. Honestly, I'm not sure what they're looking for. Lah. And the scary thing is the interviewers look very friendly. And they just came out and said, Sorry guys, uh, you all can come back again. Nadi. Game over. The one, the one, eh. no. Oh no, guys, what interview. happened? No, 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 please tell us, please tell me. Please tell me, guys. Please tell uh, me, guys. I cannot deal with failure, okay? Nah. okay no. <laughs> I unfortunately didn't make it through the debate round 
but I tried. So like the debate round, okay, we started off by introducing each other, we were paired up. The question was, should married couples stay with their family? And I was arguing against it. Aww. <laughs> okay. Hey guys, welcome back to the studio. I thought the questions were damn easy. Yeah. It's funny about easy questions. What? It's just. <laughs> <you're> <laughs> easy, Why? The fair food is damn easy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah, do you prefer sunrise or sunset? This kind of question, right? No matter how you answer it, it will just sound very fake. Yeah, that's true. Which is why I think my whole group was rejected. But I said something. I prefer sunrise because it's the start of a brand new day. <laughs> I read. I read online that you should try to somehow weave in like health and fitness. So my question was, what's your favorite food? And I said my mom's nasi ayam. Not normal nasi ayam. You know, my mom's nasi ayam. Yeah. Mom for because Mother's Day is coming up. <laughs> and like, you can't be mentioning your mom, right? Yeah, but I know sure. they don't care. What we noticed was that when other people were talking, the interviewers were uh, talking at like, uh, were looking at like, how you were holding yourself, how you stood, how your hand movement and gestures gestures were. No. I feel it's no. a bit random because like, for the people who did get through, they also probably wouldn't know why they got through. Yeah. yeah. Like you, you know why you got the second stage? No. Exactly. It's just quite fascinating how they end up there because you never know, right? Yes. How they got in. Yeah, I think yeah. they probably also don't know how they got in. Yeah. I think, I think if anything, you'll be more intrigued as to like, oh, maybe there is something about that guy that, you know, mm. uh, managed to get him through all the way. Yeah, but you don't know what it is. Like when I look at it as you just now, like, it's, I'm not just going to see like a pretty face. Yeah. I'm, in my mind, oh, I'm yeah, think, no, definitely. oh, she, she or he managed to get through everything yeah. to become that yeah. and all the training and all. It's really quite a lot. Respect. I think, I think it was very eye opening. Uh. Yeah. I think there's a growing misconception that SIA interviews are getting very easy to get in. Mm -hmm. So that's what a lot of people felt. I think that's why we were all so shocked that it was not that easy to get in. I think it was a very humbling experience. Mm. Like before that, right? I, I think all of us wouldn't have expected that none of us would get through. Yeah. <laughs> we yeah. thought at least, at least one. one. At least one. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, we thought two would, we get, thought two people would get through all the way to the final. Yeah. So yeah. I think it's very easy to make like, generalizations mm. without like really understanding what goes behind it. So I think that's one thing I learned. And another thing is that there are really a lot of people who have a lot of grit and keep on trying. Yes. So we met like uh, one girl just this year alone. She's really tried three times. Then the other guy tried, tried yeah. five times. Four, 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 four times. times. So, so it takes a lot of dedication. It lot. Like it shows that if you really want something, right, you get, you really go for it. No, but I think if I was actually serious, right, I would wear proper yeah. stuff. Go wear all the way. Wear a tie, yeah. wear a blazer, or I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't have to wear shave. Nicely. Thank God. Right? But I think for the next round, yeah, yeah. If, if I do ever go again, I would shave, wear a suit, tie, everything, the whole deal. Yeah. Yeah. yeah well, there you guys also said yeah that there was someone who wears t-shirt and jeans, right? A uh, ripped jeans. Ripped jeans. Yeah. <laughs> it was an aesthetic choice. <laughs> Adriel being shameless as he is whips out his phone and starts zooming into him. Yeah. Just like Adriel, stop it. <laughs> they had each other to accompany, but first, just like a bad <laughs> So I had to make small choice around here. Yeah. Okay, thanks for watching. So you can watch more of our videos over there. And remember to like, share and subscribe. Until our next video. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.